Hi, my name is Tommy Myers and I'm going to be cooking you a recipe from my new book, Home Cook. It's going to be poached eggs with melted leeks and a chipotle tahini dressing. So I've cut these leeks in half and now I'm just going to chop them, probably about the width of your finger. So my butter is sizzling away and I'm just going to throw in the leeks. These will take about 10 minutes just to really soften down. I just want them so that they've kind of wilted and collapsed in all that delicious butter. And the moment those leeks are in, I'm going to season them because I love seasoning things early on. Lovely big pinch of sea salt, some black pepper. So while those are cooking, I'm going to make the dressing. So I'm going to take clove of garlic and just sprinkle some salt on it and just give it a little squish. My leeks have only been in for five minutes and they've already really softened down. So I have crushed my clove of garlic. I'm going to add a tablespoon of tahini. I've got my chipotles and adobo here. And look at that colour. Now, we've got the nuttiness of the sesame and the tahini, that smoky fiery chilli. We need some sharp citrus in there. So the juice of half a lemon to start with. And I'm going to turn those down a bit now because they are almost done and they are smelling delicious. For this dressing, you could add mayonnaise if you want, but I want a bit of lightness, so I think yoghurt is the right call. If you just had tahini and chipotle, it'd be pretty punchy and fiery as well. So the yoghurt's really going to cool down that heat. I'm going to now just check the seasoning. Mm. Pinch of salt. And definitely a bit more lemon juice. So my leeks are finished, they took about eight minutes. My dressing's done, took about two minutes. All I need to do now is poach an egg. I've got a pan of simmering water here. Now the easiest way to poach an egg is to use a glass. Just crack your egg into the glass and that will help you keep its shape. Now I'm gonna add some white wine vinegar to my water. Now some people swear it helps to keep the form together. For me, it's just about flavor. A little touch of vinegar in an egg is really delicious. What you want is your pan has now come to a simmering point you don't want it simmering too fiercely because then it's just going to joggle the egg around. You just want it very, very gently simmering. So I'm going to turn the heat down a little. I'm just going to pour that egg gently into the water. There we are. And I'm going to do another one because if it's supper, I want two eggs each. And in goes number two. And now I'm going to put the ping on. Two and a half minutes. So now I'm just going to make some toast. So here are my two eggs. Kitchen paper to drain, and there they are. My toast is ready. I'm ready to plate up. I'm getting hungry. A little drizzle of olive oil. There we are, lovely. And I've got a bit of za'atar here, which is a blend of sumac, sesame, and thyme, and is delicious on these. I'm gonna put an extra bit drizzle of extra virgin olive oil on, which is delicious, full of good amigas, very good for you. And that last pinch of salt, and that is all there is to it. The perfect supper dish, melted leeks with a chipotle tahini dressing and poached eggs.